our approach at the Discovery Lab is important for the students because they don't get that in every class they're in in school. You know, there's a lot of rote memorization, there's a lot of sitting and listening to lectures, and, and those things are important. But I also think to really experience the content and to see it in a new way, it's helpful to, to build something and apply it. It's not at all like the traditional classroom model where the teacher goes to the board and, and teaches a lecture. Um, kids are more doing hands-on activities and th there is direction from the teacher from time to time, but it's, it's really all on them. I love being part of the Discovery Lab team because it's so exciting to come into class every day and see students master new concepts. I think the role of the instructor in project-based learning is, is more of a facilitator. You know, the, the instructor is not the sole arbiter of knowledge, standing at the front of the classroom and handing out their, their wisdom. They're really a partner in the students' learning to sort of help shepherd them through the difficulty of unknown answers and complex problems. In engineering, there's never a right answer. I think of engineering as a creative art, and students have to come up with their own ideas for solving a problem. So when a student comes to us and says, I don't know what to do, we say, what ideas do you have for how you can solve this problem? We're just slowly trying to encourage students to depend less on us and become more independent learners. The application of these classroom learnings to the real world happens through um, just simply the collaboration. You have a variety of backgrounds, you're gonna have so many different perspectives and I think they're able to each, each learn from each other. It's one thing for the students to experience making a project, whether it's building a bridge or uh, doing origami that relates to geometry, but it's another thing for them to be able to internalize the information and communicate it to other people. I'm so proud and I'm so just amazed by their creativity and their ability to come up with a final product that they're all proud of and they can articulate um, what they learned. We want them to feel like they can continue to succeed uh, when they face challenges that aren't clear, when they're given a project that doesn't have a, a single outcome. And I think in industry we're going to find that students who are able to persist through complex problems are going to be more successful.